on the right. Number one, the diagram on the right shows a cross section of a rectangle cover which is parabolic in shape and is presented by the equation. So it's y negative k x square, where y is the height in meter and x is the radius of the foot cover in meter. Show that k is 150. So we see here we have this equation. So if we know one of the coordinates, then we can get the value of k. So we see here this one from the top one is 50 right so it's going down so this one is negative 50 but then we see here the y is negative 50 and x is 0 right but then if you substitute 0 negative 50 if you put x as 0 then obviously you will get you won't get the value of k so this one is negative 50 so this one is 100 so this one is 50 negative 50 and this one is you see here this one is negative 50 obviously because this one is 0 and this one is negative 50. So you can use either any of the points to get the value of k. So just use let me just use the first one. So y is equal to negative 50 is equal to negative k. x is equal to negative 50 square. Right? So we see here so negative and negative can be cut off because this one is multiplication so we have 50 is equal to k negative 50 square so k is equal to so you bring to the left so 50 divided by so negative 50 square you get 2500 so which is equal to 1 over 50 so this is proven B, find the internal volume of the foot cover in term of pi. So we see here internal volume. So before this, A, I forgot to show you because we have y is equal to negative k x square, right? The graph. So obviously when y is 0, x is 0. So this one is obviously 0, 0. So in term of pi, we need to know where it rotates. So we see here, it is obviously rotating on the y axis. Why? Because if we find this, Right? So rotating to the y axis, we can get the whole shape. So we are rotating to the y axis. So the formula that I are using from which y to what y, which is obviously this one is from negative 50 up to 0. So this one is pi. So y axis means at square d y. So we have to know what is our x. So y is equal to negative k is 1 over 50. So here we have x square. If we have x square, we can directly substitute. So x square is equal to y. So this one bring to the left, we become we become what? We become okay, it's actually divided by 1 over 50, or you can directly multiply, which is become negative 50 y. So now this is from negative 50 to 0 pi. So this is x square. So negative 50 y dy. Which is equal to, so here, 0 negative 50. So we get negative 50 pi y dy. So we can take out the constant out, which is equal to negative 50 pi. 0, negative 50, y, dy is equal to negative 50 pi. So y, when we integrate, y is actually power of 1. It will become y square over 2 because you add 1 and then from um, negative 50 up to 0. Which is equal to negative 50 pi. So here, so this one I just take out. But then if you just want to leave it here and just directly integrate also, you will still get the same answer. So this one is 0, right? So I substitute 0 inside here. You get 0 square over 2, which is 0. So minus, this is done. Now, now I substitute negative 50 into y. So here negative 50, negative 50 square divided by 2. So close back. So here negative 50 pi, so 0, so we know that minus, 
So negative square you will get positive. So 2500 divided by 2. So here you will get which is equal to negative 50 pi times negative 2500 over 2. So we will get 62,500 pi. So the volume is equal to 62,500 pi centimeter cube.